Hi, I'm Herlins, and I will be reviewing a sonic screwdriver that I bought from thinkgeek.com. Awesome website. This is a uh, screwdriver. But first, it comes when you get it. It will arrive. It arrived for me in a box with Thinkgeek logo. It's a little brain above it. Uh, stuff for smart masses. Uh, it comes in a little box. It's all these papers and magazine catalog. And, um, uh, this is a little thing. It mentions a lot of it. It's the 11th Doctor Sonic Screwdriver. And I already opened it, so. But, and, uh, it's battery powered. And the, the annoying part is that the batteries are like the circular ones. So you have to unscrew, yeah, where the batteries go. And it's a really tiny screw, so it gets irritating. But, when you're putting it, you just pull twist and pull, and it's a little green section, you have to pull this back up and do the whole thing. But, um, so put it back, pretty self-explanatory how to put it back, and now this is how it works. There's two buttons, the bottom one and the top one, the top one's bigger. Bottom one, you press the sound. It only has two different sounds. Now, this is where the fun begins. So we're gonna have this button, you know. Uh -huh. Now, the t the button on the top of it. Uh is the sprinkler in action. If you watch the show, you got it. it. Goes like that. And uh to put it back in, you gotta push on the green thing. I'm trying to find epic or now, I just pull it back inward, kind of like what Matt Smith does a lot. And, um, the thing about it is when you put it out, you can't use the button on, on the bottom. It just doesn't work for when it's, uh, when it's sprung out. So, yeah, they're, uh, so yeah, they pretty much give you this little thing at the bottom where it opens up, usually automatically when you press it. You can pull it out. It's a red button. You just push, and it works, like... Plus it works also when it's unsprung, just regular. And but I kinda don't like it. It's kinda awkward. So there's a little black button in there, uh, in the same column as the buttons, so it's it's kinda hard to press, but you press it. And they also does the same thing. So, I don't, like, I don't know how to explain this, but, like, when I first saw this, I was expecting it to be more, like, sort of metal-ish. Not so, so much plasticky. Although, I got over it so quickly, like, after, like, five seconds. I just got, fell in love with this thing. But, uh, well, it'd be cool, though, if it was metal, like, it'd be, like, be even like more realistic, but it's just a replica. And you can also get the tenth doctors and the third doctors on this website, which is pretty cool. And it's in the description. Thinkgeek.com. They have a whole section of Doctor Who stuff. Pretty cool. Now, see subscribe, like my videos, I don't just do reviews, but, um, you know, this, I just felt like I had to, this thing was so awesome, and see y'all next time, bye.